I'm standing on the next tee <laughs> raging. <laughs> Stand a little wider so you have a bit more of a wide, wider takeaway. A bit more speed. Like that. Like that. Like that. All good, mate. Okay, hit it harder, use the grind more. Feel like you're jumping out of your shoes. Yeah. Works. So for me, um, it's a lot uh, about how do you use the ground. I will just make sure that I shift my weight to the right side and lift a little bit that left, that left side. Then when I'm on the downswing, I will just use it as a push to jump. And for me, this is how you create like the release and the shallow, the shallow clubs, and it will create like more club speed for sure. Instead of swinging hard, it's almost more important to get center contact, I think, because when your smash factor goes up, you're actually gaining your maximum ball speed out of it. So, you know, I just think that really focusing on hitting in the center of the face is, um, is going to help you kind of get, you know, 10 more yards. Redo. Cut. Most amateurs hit down on the ball. If you're hitting up on the ball, you get less spin. So then your launch is better and you should hit it further. There we go. Is that a fair way? Uh, well, First one of the day? Uh, I can't do it, so. Um, I'm like, I'm at a speed and that's about it. Tee it higher, a bit more carry out of it, give it a run. Let's hit the ball. Hit the ball 10 yards further, I would say lift your left heel. Hit it harder. <laughs> Something like that. I should hit it like that every time. Well, first of all, you gotta swing it a bit faster. So maybe in your practice swing, just try to swing it a little bit faster, create some speed. And the second tip is that would be squeeze your hands a little bit harder on the grip, because if you swing it faster, the club head is gonna tend to maybe flip a little faster as well. So I usually tend to squeeze my hands uh, a little bit stronger than normal. That's what I'm talking about. Like <laughs> Have to squeeze your hands. <laughs> to hit it 10 yards further. Probably, yeah, one tip. Start from the box in front of us. Anyway, why are you asking the players out to see further? They haven't got a clue on it. How you would I know? Case, so. <laughs> There's no point in asking them. They've got nothing up here. You know what I, mean? I mean, not to be condescending or anything, but swing a little harder. Of course, if you don't hit it in the center of the face, it's not going to go any further. Try and launch the drive a little bit more. And that could, uh, in the setup, that could be, you feel like your left knee is a little lower than the, your right knee is lower than your left knee a little bit. So when, when you set up there, you're staying a little better behind the ball. And then from there, you can kind of hit more up on the ball and that's going to give you a little bit more yard. I would make my stance a little bit wider. 
but standing taller. And then for me, I have a shift off the ball and get, get my hands pretty much as far away from the, the ground as I can or where the start as I can. And just smash it. Can't see that either. Play the previous hole like a complete piece of and stand on the next tee raging and then just fire the cannon. You raging then? No, I just surprised myself though. It's actually quite nice. I love that, yeah. <laughs> See you guys. So watch another DP World Tour video, click here. And to subscribe, click here.